Donc, oui, tiens. Please be seated. Veuillez vous asseoir. The court is now back in session. Reprise de l'audience. And the chamber will give the floor to Kyosampan's defense la to put the questions to this civil party. Counsel, you have the floor. Maître, vous avez la parole. Defense counsel, thank you, Mr. President, and good Merci, afternoon, Madame Civil Party. Bonjour, Madame la partie I only civile. have a few uh, questions uh, to put to you. When you were asked about your place of birth by the co-prosecutor, you made some reply, but uh, to get clarification, né, and in your réponses, response, uh, you said that you were uh, born in uh, Cambodia. My question to you is the moi, following. Vous poser à présent la question suivante. In a document, the 22-3205, which is a victim information form, de, du that is your victime. victim information form, de votre à vous. it uh, stated that uh, your uh, nationality is uh, Khmer Kampuchea Crown. And my question to you is the following. Are you aware that uh, that was the case? Pourriez-vous nous confirmer que c'était bien le cas? Civil party, of course, I know because I lived in Cambodia Crown, my crown. Bien sûr, parce que je vivais au Cambodia Crown. J'étais Cambodia, j'étais Khmer Crown. My question to you is the why there you are you are a Khmer Crown or you are a Khmer person? Answer, I am a, an upper Khmer or Khmer Le. Je suis Khmer Le Council, thank you. Khmer However, in your victim information Question. form to Mais become a civil party, victime, vous it avez is great that civile, your nationality is a Khmer Crown. And my question to you is why it is stated that you are Khmer Crown on that victim information form? Dans ce formulaire, on indique que vous étiez Khmer Chrome. Answer. I came to live uh, in uh, Khmer Le. Réponse. Although je suis I used to live in uh, Khmer Chrome. Mais auparavant, je vivais dans le Khmer, le My Kampuchy question Krom. to you is about uh, what is question. recorded on the Moi, victim information form, which it states that uh, your nationality is Khmer Krom. And I want to know uh, why there is a, a difference. As you stated, you are not Khmer Crown. But on the form, it is uh, right that uh, your nationality is Khmer Crown. And my question to you is why there is a such a discrepancy? Answer, yes, I understand your question. I I had a nationality as a Khmer Crown, but then I came to live in a Cambodia or Upper Khmer or Khmer Le. Question. When you lived in Vietnam, what was your nationality? Or was it a Khmer Crown? Answer. When I came to Cambodia or Upper Khmer, I changed my nationality as what it is currently known. But I was born in Khmer Krom. Mais je suis né au Cambodia Krom. So let me be perfectly clear that did you? Refer to your nationality as Khmer Crown in the past. Par le passé, estimiez-vous que votre nationalité était Khmer Crown? Réponse: Oui. 
I used to refer to my nationality as I was born in Vietnam. Question, can you specify whether you, you used to say your nationality was Vietnamese or Khmer Krom? Uh, please uh, respond as uh, what you said did not go through Veuillez the répéter, interpretation plaît, system. Answer, uh, my nationality was Kampuchea uh, Krom. Question. Question. On your identification card, Sur votre carte identité, which is also, uh, on the document D22 slash 3205. On a copy of your ID card, it, uh, it reads that uh, your place of birth was a pre-village Saum commune, Kiribung district, Takai province. Why did you state? Uh, a place of birth on the ID, which is not true. Alors pourquoi ces informations semblent-elles fausses? Answer. It was a process or organized Réponse. by my mother when the ID card was made. At that time, I was rather young, so it was not. Uh, I did not know about that. Je n'étais pas vraiment au courant. Council, the Question. identification card that I refer to is actually a Votre new identification card of the uh, Kingdom of uh, Cambodia, and it is a sign, or it is made on the 17 uh, July 2002. 2002. So it was about uh, 12 years ago. And it was issued by the Phnom Penh municipality. At the time of its issuance, were you still a young girl or were you already an adult or woman? Answer. I was already mature. Question. Question. Who made that uh, ID card? Was it you or was it your mother? Qui a fait cette carte d'identité? Était-ce votre mère ou Answer. bien vous? Answer. It was uh, organized by Réponse. my mother. Ma Question. Mère qui a tout so organisé. you did not go through uh, the place where the ID was uh, processed or made? Vous êtes donc pas rendu Answer. Là yes. Où la carte a été Question. Réponse Because non. for the ID Question. processing, you had to be uh, there yourself en to be photographed and to fill in the particulars, photo, and it could not be done by uh, someone else on your behalf. Is that the case? En votre nom. Answer. Yes, Réponse. I went there and oui, to have allée. my uh, photograph taken. Je me suis fait prendre en photo. I went there. I went there by myself. J'y suis allé effectivement. Question. Let me question. go back to my uh, question. Je reviens Why there à la question précédente. There is a difference in your nationality. Il you stated that you were born in uh, Khmer Crown, but on your ID card, you uh, mentioned that you were born in uh, Cambodia, that is in Creole village, Saum Commune, Kiribong district, Takai province. Can you tell the chamber why there is such a difference? Answer. Réponse. I, in fact, was born in Priel Village, Kiribong District, at Takai Province. Village de Kril, Question. De Takeo, so, de the statement you made Question. previously that you were born in Vietnam is not Vous correct. Is that true? Au Vietnam. Donc faux. Answer. 
Yes, I was born in Kirivong district, Takao province, and I was not born in Khmer Crown, and I apologize for the mistake. Council, thank you. Question. Merci. Can you recall who actually helped you in uh, filling the victim information form? Vous a aidé à remplir le formulaire d'information sur les victimes. Formulaire de renseignement. Answer. What form are you referring to? De quel formulaire parlez-vous? Council. Question. I refer to the victim information form, which has a, a document ID that is D22-3205. Do you recall that? Answer. I remember someone gave me an assistance in filling out that form. Question, do you know the name Question. of the person? Answer, yes. Question, what is the name? Réponse, oui. Question, comment s'appelait cette personne? Answer, uh, the name was Nyan. C'était Nyan. Council, thank you. Question, merci. In that uh, same document, dans that is document, the victim information form, formulaire de renseignement. at the uh, location where a witness provided a thumbprint, it stated that a person that provided a thumbprint as a witness is Chao Ni. Do you know that a person that is Chao Ni? Chao Ni. Est-ce que vous connaissez quelqu'un qui s'appelle Chao Ni? Answer. No, I don't know uh, uh, the, anyone by the non, name of Chao Ni. Personne qui s'appellerait Chao Ni. Counsel. Question. On your victim information form, this person non, Chao Ni signed that form Chao as a witness. En tant que témoin. So, uh, your response is that you don't know this person or never uh, meet this person, Chao Ni. Uh, can you uh, confirm that? Le Answer. I do not know uh, any person réponse. by the name of uh, Chao Ni. Not at all. Absolument pas. And I have uh, never seen an individual by that name. Je jamais vu personne s'appeler ainsi. Counsel, Question. this person, Chao Ni, actually Chao came Ni to testify before this chamber in case 02-01 as a civil party. Maybe this can refresh your memory. Answer. No, réponse, non. I do not know this person and Je ne pas cette personne. I don't have any contact with this person. Je aucun contact, uh, President, aucun lien avec cette personne. Uh, Defense Counsel. Le Monsieur l'avocat de la Défense. You should actually direct your question on the statement of uh, suffering or impact uh, of the civil party. That is the main purpose of this afternoon the proceeding. The Defense Council, uh, yes, Mr. President. And now I move on to another uh, topic that is about the uh, Reparation. J'aimerais parler de réparation. In document D25-3205, says the council on the last page. Page ce document. In the English language, which is only a one-page document, uh, it is uh, towards the au, au verso end of the document, page. which uh, reads, and uh, let me quote, 
in this complaint, I would like to ask for some compensation for my mental sufferings and the property that I lost during the Khmer Rouge regime, such as houses, cattle, buffaloes, and so on. End of quote. My question to you, Madame Civil Party, is the following. Do you, do you still stand by your request for an individual reparation as stated on this document? Answer. Of course, I uh, uh, request for a reparation, and if sûr, it is awarded, of course, that is good. If it's not, what can I do? Si because I lost my property, what else I can do besides uh, uh, making that claim? Council, can you demande? make it a bit uh, clearer? Question, Are you still uh, uh, making a request for an award or reparation, or do you forfeit it? Continuez-vous à penser que vous devez obtenir réparation ou renoncez-vous à ces réparations I don't want to claim for anything else, but I want to, to claim for my husband. I want my husband to be back. My husband and my lost child. J'ai perdu un enfant également. Council. You seem to not to respond to my uh, question, and if you wish not to respond question. to my question, si I'll enter my question, question now. Avec mon Answer. I don't know Réponse. what else uh, I can uh, ask for, as I already lost uh, my uh, property. Council. The reason question. that I ask you this question is because you made that a statement on the form that is your request for the reparation for the loss of your houses, cattle, so on and so forth during the Democratic Cambodia regime. And my question is that are you still standing by your request for reparations or compensations as stated on that form? Answer. I don't know what else I uh, can say regarding the compensations. Because I, I, I am illiterate, I don't know what else I can do. Council, thank you, Mr. President. I don't have any further questions for this civil party. President, uh, thank you, uh, Madame Taksan, for uh, your uh, statement of uh, suffering and harms that uh, you suffered under the Democratic Cambodia regime. And your time is now expired, and you may return to wherever you wish to go. And the Chamber wish you a safe journey. Court officer, in collaboration with the WISU, please make necessary transportation of Madame Taksan to her uh, residence or wherever she wishes to go to. And as for the TPO staff, please remain seated as you may, as you are uh, required to provide assistance to another civil party that is to TCCP 985. And uh, court officer, please usher that civil party into the courtroom. President, good afternoon, Le Madame President, Civil Party. Bonjour, what is your name? Civil Party. 
La partie My name is Im Yen. Je m'appelle Im Yen. Question. Thank you very much, Madame Le Im Yen. Merci beaucoup, Madame. When were you born? Quelle est votre date de naissance? Answer. I was born on the 8th of uh, September 1970. But uh, I was actually born in 1968. President, where were you born? What is your current address, rather? Answer, I live in Tulpungro com, uh, village, Saom commune, Grivong district, in Takao province. Question, uh, what is your occupation? Question, quelle est votre profession? Answer, Réponse. I am a rice farmer. Je Question, what are your parents' names? Question, comment se nomment vos parents? Answer. My Réponse. father's name is Mom Pro. Mom Pro. What is your mother's name? Et comment s'appelle votre mère? Demande le président. Answer. My mother's Réponse. name is. Ma mère se nomme. Om Yon. Om Yon. Question. What is your husband's name? How many Quel children do you have together? Et combien d'enfants avez-vous avec lui? Answer. My husband's Réponse. name is Sam On. Il s'appelle. I have Om. seven children. J'ai sept enfants. President, thank you very much. Président, je vous the chamber now hands over the floor to the lead co-lawyer to put questions to the civil party in relation to the sufferings and injuries she experienced during the democratic Cambodia. You may proceed. Council. Thank you very much. My name is Lao Chun Thi. I am the civil party lawyer. Good afternoon, Madame Im Yen. My first question is that in 1975, you were, where were you transferred uh, in 1975? Answer. In 1975, I went to leave. I was transferred from Tulpungro village, Saom commune, District to live in Tropeng Thom Kang Chung commune. Tramkok District, Takao province. Council, thank you. What about in 1976? What unit uh, were you transferred to? Answer, in 1976, they sent me to live in Tulkru village. During which I was separated from à my parents and I was asked to work. Et on demandé de travailler. I was asked to dig uh, the uh, earth at Tulkru Dam. We were separated in uh, ten groups. And Nous avons été en there were 50 units in one group, and uh, I was asked to dig uh, the the earth. And uh, 10 people, we, we were asked to dig 10 
cubic uh, meter and if we were in the 15 member group we were asked to dig a 15 meter cubic cubic meters of soil uh, if i could not uh, complete uh, the Quota, uh, I uh, would be deprived of food. In 1977, I uh, ran to see my uh, parents, and I, I was uh, captured at that time. And after that, I was asked to uh, go and collect uh, the cow dung. I could not perform my duty because I was too young at that time. Since I was too young, I uh, missed my parents at that time because I uh, missed my parents too much. Uh, I uh, was arrested and I was uh, buried for a few hours. I was warned not to do such a thing again, otherwise I would be killed. I was uh, very hungry and I was very thirsty. I was buried uh, up to my neck. I called uh, for my parents' help, but uh, no one could come to help me. I underwent uh, suffering at that time. After that time, I uh, was uh, put back into my unit. When I was buried uh, up to my neck, I, uh, I uh, was left there for a while Lorsque and later on I was put back in the unit to work in 1978. I was asked to uh, cut containing kite uh, plants to mix with uh, the urines and the, and the swine. Uh, to make uh, fertilizers, and uh, the, the fertilizer was uh, cooked in a big pot, and uh, we were asked to uh, carry uh, the fertilizer which were put in the pots. In fact, uh, I tried to escape from uh, my units a few times, two or three times. I, uh, at that time, was arrested uh, again and again. I was put in uh, the cooperative bag uh, after my arrest. Uh, I, I was waiting at that time, and I was uh, very... Uh, hungry, I stole some food to eat. Since I was uh, too hungry, I uh, went, I chased the ox car to uh, steal uh, a few uh, cassava. I was spotted at that time. Un peu de manioc, mais on I, uh, because I was spotted, I threw uh, back uh, the uh, cassava onto uh, the cassava, onto the ox cart. Pour le remettre sur la charrette d'où je l'avais subtilisé. Later, I, I was put in uh, the soy dam. Ensuite, on m'a envoyé I au was barrage de Tassoy. Where I uh, was. Uh, I I told uh, them that uh, I uh, was put in Tatsui Dam. There were uh, Unit 1 and Unit 2. I was taken by the chief of the unit. I did not know why I was uh, brought. And when I was asked to climb up the, the house, Lorsque I uh, was uh, tied maison, up. And I was told that because I, I stole something, I uh, was tied up. Que comme commis un voleur, uh, as I said, I was tied up. Uh, my uh, legs uh, were tied up Les and my hands were tied to the back, behind my back. They tied my hair to uh, the uh, window bar. I was thirsty during that time. I called a person Bong and I asked for water. I was deprived of food. I was so starved and hungry. 
I asked uh, for food affamé. and water for a few time, and uh, de la à he reprises. did not hear what I asked. Mais pas At the third time, when I asked uh, again, fois, uh, I was uh, given demandé, a water. On demandé, on donné, pardon, de and uh, after that, uh, the uh, chief of the unit uh, brought in a whip or a bamboo a stick. And uh, they hit on my abdomen. Et and I was warned that uh, next time, please uh, do not uh, go and uh, steal something. And I replied, no, I, I would not do it again. When night falls, uh, the other children tombée, came to uh, the house. I discussed uh, with the two Alors, children that uh, I wanted to go to relieve myself. The two children did not dare to ask, uh, but I decided to ask uh, that person. And uh, during that time, I pretended to relieve myself for a long uh, period of time because uh, I, my legs and foot were so hurt. At night time, when the children uh, return from their work, le soir, les sont du travail, when uh, at night time, when the other children returned to, to uh, uh, their returned from their work, uh, they also saw that uh, the two children and I were tied up. Également pensé que les deux enfants et moi avions été attachés. And uh, after that time, I was called to a self-criticism uh, meeting. And uh, the, at that time, there was a child uh, standing up to say that uh, those who committed wrong should uh, come to confess. So I confessed uh, at that time. And after the meeting, I was asked uh, to go back to work. I was told that on the 10th and the 20th of every month to rest But as time went on, uh, the rest time uh, was reduced, and uh, I did not uh, uh, enjoy any uh, rest on the 10 or the 20th of every month. Counsel, you responded you stated that uh, you were allowed to visit your parents on the 10th and 20th of every month. Since you enjoyed that uh, latitude, why uh, did you still uh, go to see your parents on other days? Answer. I stated that uh, there was the 10th and the 20th of every month that we were allowed to go and visit our parents. But uh, our rest time to visit our parents was reduced. Because of this, I uh, ran to visit uh, my uh, parents. I was young at that time. I need uh, my parents to take care of me. Food ration was reused. The time to visit my parents was reused. So I decided to uh, uh, sneak to see my parents. Counsel, during that time, you were assigned in a mobile unit. À cette époque -là, on Did, a was there any uh, training or education uh, sessions in your mobile unit? Au sein de votre unité itinérante? Answer. During Réponse. that time, there was no education session. Uh, we were only asked to work uh, at daytime and nighttime. time. 
Council. What about food ration? You stated that during the time that you went to collect uh, the pig dung and cow dung, uh, you stole uh, uh, cassava. What about the food ration during that time? How was it? Answer. I uh, stole cassava at the time that I uh, went to collect uh, uh, the pig and cow dung because I did not have enough food. That is why I decided to steal uh, the cassava. Council, you said that you were arrested when you were stealing uh, the cassava and you vous avez were dit que vous tortured. Arrêté pendant que vous voliez du Your vous legs avez été and torturé. hands were tied up. Vous avez dit que vos jambes uh, is vos that true? Avaient été ligotées. Est -ce exact? Answer. Réponse. Yes, uh, I stated that I uh, was oui, tortured at that time. Été I uh, was so hungry at that time, that is why I, uh, I affamée, went to steal the cassava. I was arrested while I was manioc, stealing cassava, and I was uh, through, thrown uh, onto the cart of a few times. And after that, I was uh, 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 taken to be tortured. Ensuite, on m'a torturé. Council. You said you were separated from your vous avez parents. Dit que vous avez été de was it? Parents. Does, uh, did it happen? from the 1976 until 1979 answer I was separated from my parents from 1976 but uh, I was allowed to visit my parents three times a month and let the on the, my visit time was reduced to once a month only. Ensuite, and as I was young, I uh, missed uh, my uh, parents so petite, miserably. Mes parents me manquaient énormément. Council, you said that you miss your parents miserably. Did you ask permission to visit your parents at that time? Answer, I miss them so much. I wanted to ask permission to visit my parents. I uh, didn't. I was. I did not allow. I was not allowed to do so because uh, they had uh, the schedule for me to visit uh, my parents on specific dates, and I asked uh, them already a few times, but I was not allowed to visit my parents. Council, you stated earlier that uh, the chief uh, unit arrested you and uh, buried you. What was this the kind of uh, uh, torture that you experienced and why were you tortured? Quel type de torture avez-vous subi et pourquoi avez-vous été torturé? Answer. I mentioned that I was arrested and uh, buried on m'a dit que j'ai été The reason was that I ran away from my unit to visit my parents. Quitté mon unité pour rendre visite à mes parents. Counsel, when you were a buried. L'avocat Were you buried alone, or were you vous avez été enterré, being buried in front of others? So how were you buried? 
Avez-vous été enterrée toute seule ou yeah, est devant d'autres personnes Answer. Réponse. There was a pit uh, which can Il y avait put me in. Des fosses And uh, I was uh, buried uh, deep uh, to my neck uh, as a warning for me not to commit such a wrong again. Enterré jusqu'au niveau du cou. Pour ne pas que je recommence. Counsel, when you were being buried, Were you allowed to have some food? Vous avez été enterré. Est-ce qu'on vous a? Est-ce que vous aviez droit à la nourriture? At that time, I was deprived of food and of water. I was starved and so thirsty. My whole body was in pain. I called for my parents' help, but no one could come to help me. Crier pour que mes parents viennent à After I was arrested, I was uh, buried, uh, not in front of other. The other children went already went to work, and uh, I was buried at the unit where I was uh, staying at that time. Some more. My last question to you is the following. Can you please uh, tell the chamber that uh, when you were separated from your parents and that you were not given an opportunity to go to school, what was your feeling about that? And also on the matter that you were arrested and uh, buried, beaten and tortured, allow you to make a statement about uh, that suffering or whether you can compare such a suffering uh, to something uh, that you can uh, do uh, for the chamber. Answer. I was buried alive and nothing could compare to it. I was buried uh, up to my neck. I could not move and I could not do anything. I tried to call my parents, but no one would answer my call. And it was the greatest pain I experienced. Questioned Question. up to today, has that suffering gone, or is it still living with you? À ce jour, êtes-vous encore habité par cette souffrance, ou est-ce que cette souffrance vous a quitté? Every time Réponse. I recall it. It is vividly living in front of my eyes as I was living during the regime. And that happened every time I recall it. I recall it. Question. And uh, the lingering effect of what happened there will give you any consequence uh, or impact upon your Les current life? Uh, can you uh, describe it to the court? Cette époque des répercussions sur votre vie Answer. During the regime, I did not have a chance uh, to go uh, to school. Pendant le régime, je n'ai pas eu la possibilité d'aller à l'école. Et maintenant, je suis uneducé. Je ne sais pas quelque chose de mieux que personne. À ce moment-là, il n'y avait pas d'école et je n'étais pas allowé à attendre des études. Et l'on ne m'a pas autorisé à suivre des cours. Qu'est-ce que vous avez de votre condition de santé Qu'en est-il de votre état de santé? Answer. Health wise, sir. Health wise, sir. I am not that strong. Réponse. During the regime, I was still young and I was forced to overwork. Quand j'étais pendant les pendant l'époque du régime, j'étais jeune et on m'a forcé à travailler au-delà de mes forces. 
question. Question. Finally, do you have any uh, questions that you wish to put to the two accused? Avez-vous des questions à poser aux deux accusés? Answer. Réponse. I have two questions that I like to ask them. My first poser. question is the following. Est la suivante. Why do you two inflicted the torture on Pourquoi children like myself? What were you thinking about when you did that? Des enfants comme moi? Mais à quoi pensiez -vous? President, uh, Defense Council, uh, you have the floor if President, you have uh, some matter to raise. It is uh, my observation uh, that the question that to the accused uh, is not uh, directed uh, through uh, the president of the chamber. Uh, could you please uh, give such instruction to the civil party? Civil party lawyer, uh, Mr. President. Avocat. Pour la partie civile. Monsieur le Président. I asked uh, whether the uh, civil party has any question si for uh, the accused and as the civil party does not know about the standing procedures in this court, could you please uh, accept the question by the civil party? President, la posée par la uh, does he have any more questions? Council, I don't have any further questions. Question? Réponse. President. Je pas question. Le président. And Madame Ian Jane. Madame Ian Jane. The chamber wishes to inform you that after ascertaining the position of both accused on 8 January 2015 2015, regarding the exercise of the right to remain silent, the chamber notes that the two accused maintain their expressed position unless and until such time the chamber is expressly informed otherwise by the co-accused or their counsels. It is therefore incumbent upon them to inform the chamber in a timely and efficient manner should the accused a resolve to waive the right to remain silent and be willing to respond to questions by the bench or relevant parties at any stage of the proceedings. Insofar as of the day, the Chamber is not informed that the co-accused have changed their express position and has agreed to provide their responses to uh, questions. President, and the co-prosecutors, do you intend to put questions to the civil party? Deputy National Co-Prosecutor, uh, President, uh, yes, we do have some questions. President, uh, thank you for your uh, clarification. President, je vous remercie. President, uh, today's proceeding has come to an adjournment. The chamber will adjourn now and uh, resume tomorrow. That is the 2nd April 2015, commencing from 9 o'clock in the morning. For a tomorrow a proceeding, we will continue to hear the testimony of the statement of suffering and harm by this current civil party, Ian Jane, and three other civil parties, two TCCP 288, two TCCP 981, and through TCCP 893, this information is for both the uh, parties and the uh, public. And Madame Imjent, uh, the 
Chamber is grateful for your time to provide a statement of suffering and harm. However, it is not yet concluded. Therefore, you are invited to return tomorrow morning to this courtroom uh, to uh, continue at 9 o'clock in the morning. And court officer, please make an arrangement uh, in collaboration with Wisu uh, for the civil party to return to her uh, residence or place of stay and have her return into the uh, courtroom tomorrow at 9 o'clock. And the TPL staff, you are also uh, invited uh, to return uh, tomorrow morning to assist uh, the civil party and security personnel. You are instructed to take the two accused back to the detention facility and return them to the uh, courtroom tomorrow morning before 9 o'clock. The court is now adjourned.